DJI has recently released a new Inspire 3 firmware in early November. You have the option to update the firmware either through the app or by utilizing DJI Assistant 2. We now offer a pre-flight check feature. Upon powering on the remote controller and launching DJI Pilot 2, the live view will present the parameter check interface. This convenient tool allows you to verify essential drone settings, including the visual positioning switch, obstacle avoidance switch, and signal lost action, ensuring their accurate configuration. The Vision Assist feature has been introduced, allowing for improved environmental awareness around the drone to ensure safe flight. To enable Vision Assist, navigate to the flight controller settings. Once enabled, the Vision Assist view will dynamically adjust based on the drone's speed and direction. Additionally, you have the option to manually choose the view direction by tapping on the directional arrow within the FPV camera view. Tap and hold to lock the selected view direction. Cruise control is added, enabling you to effortlessly maintain the current flight status throughout your flight. This feature offers a more focused control of the gimbal. Enter the remote controller settings in DJI Pilot 2 and you can set one of the customizable buttons on the remote controller to cruise control. Upon configuring your desired settings, simply press the cruise control button during flight, and the aircraft will lock the current stick input of the remote controller and fly automatically. Push the control stick after it returns to the center. Press the cruise control button again, and the aircraft will fly at the increased speed based on the previous speed. To exit cruise control, Press the flight pause button on the remote controller once, or press the cruise control button without a control stick input. We have now enhanced the display capability to provide you with detailed information on the propulsion system status. While in sport mode or ATTI mode, you will find the current power status of the aircraft conveniently displayed at the bottom of the screen. Keep an eye on the power status icon, as a red icon indicates that the motor speed has reached its maximum limit potentially affecting the flight performance. We kindly remind you to exercise caution when flying under such conditions. The altitude measured by the downward infrared sensing system is now visible in all flight modes. When maneuvering the aircraft at lower altitudes, the position adjacent to the attitude indicator will conveniently show the altitude above ground level. In addition, we have also added the following features. Time shot, allowing you to do time-lapse photography. Vibration notification is added to the remote controller when the aircraft is hovering after takeoff, making it easier for you to achieve seamless transitions between the sky and the ground. Edit flight, allowing you to use the existing flight route. Display horizontal obstacle information when using sport mode. Set standby at start point when using repeatable routes mode. After gaining the control of the gimbal, the gimbal mode will automatically switch. Add files to my favorites when using album. Camera index and reel count can be recorded to the metadata. For more in-depth update information, please refer to the release notes.